Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernardo from the BTN HD, and yes, uh, Android, Android operating system. I think I did a video with you guys of how to uh, build a Android operating system with VMware. Uh, it looks like it was a little complicated, but someone was nice enough to build this awesome little application, which is a virtual machine. Everything is pre-built. Everything is within the installation file. It give you everything all you have to do is install it now I'm not gonna show you guys how to install the files or the program into your machine uh, there is a link at the bottom that goes directly to my site uh, for full description and instruction step-by-step -step on how to install it and get yourself up and running I just want to show you guys how it looks because I'm super excited uh, that the application comes from Andy Andy Roid dot net <laughs> And it's awesome. I, I love the robot for the first thing. I like the little icon. The little robot kind of thing is awesome. Uh, they they only have it for the PC version. I know, sad face. They are working. They're, they're actually working on the Mac version, which is going to be coming out pretty soon. When the Mac version does come out, I will do a video review on that. But for now, this is what it is. Uh, it gives you the rundown. You can actually run an Android operating system, but all kind of apps install whatever games you want and play it on your machine like you're running it on a physical Android device which is awesome I love that stuff because when it comes in when it comes to me when I like to do my top three top five apps reviews or I like to play around with applications and see how it works I don't want to use it on my physical machine right I want to do it on a testing environment so they give you a nice comparison chart of the other two products in the market and it's blue stacks which I've heard but a lot of people don't really like it that much and then you got U Wave which I never heard before and it's 20 bucks who wants to pay 20 bucks for it Andy is totally free and look at all the features that I have the only thing that it doesn't support which the other two don't support is run apps from the desktop actually uh, hardware console is the only thing that all three of them do don't but Andy does run uh, apps on the desktop so when you guys follow the instructions at my site, you're going to get these two little icons right here. It's going to install VirtualBox automatically on your machine. Okay. If you already have VirtualBox on your machine, it's just going to install and configure the virtual machine for you. So I'm actually going to double click on Oracle VM VirtualBox. I want to show you what it actually installs. And install this nice little virtual machine for you to run your Android OS within your laptop or workstation on your PC. Uh, operating system type is a Linux 32 is 32 bit it gives it a gig but when you're installing this make sure that your machine has about 10 to 15 gigs of space because if you look at the virtual disk one of them is 541 and two of them is 5 gigs and 7 gigs so make sure you have enough space plus whatever apps you're gonna be installing it's gonna be installing it locally into your machine so let's get this started I don't I don't recommend starting it this way uh, they actually give you a nice little shortcut and all you gotta do is just double click on the shortcut it's called Andy uh, I I'm trying to figure out what the code name of Andy stands for uh, but once it starts up as you can see at the bottom it says Android is running OpenGL that's the kind of codec that it's running on the back side you get a nice little Android welcoming sign it's just like running a Google Nexus tablet oh, I miss my Google tablet so much and you're gonna get this uh, the front page let me full screen this bad boy for you guys and this is new I don't know why this has popped up but every time I do that that happens so that's weird so let's uh, go back there we go let's do landscape or device there you go and uh, like a regular Android device you click on your apps you get all your apps uh, if, if you guys went to my site follow that link at the bottom of the description you're gonna see the step-by-step -step. it actually allows you to uh, configure your Gmail again you're physically running an active stable version of the Android OS it's like you're physically holding an Android tablet device in your hand and you're just swiping it but you're running on a PC which is awesome you could do all kinds of testing you could answer emails uh, go back uh, I actually downloaded a jetpack joyride game for my son because he 
he saw it and he was like, uh, Daddy, that's a tablet on a computer? And I was like, no, it's not. Uh, it's, it's a, I was trying to explain to him a virtual machine. Trying to explain a virtual machine to a five-year-old is kind of kind of funny. But uh, he started playing with it. I started playing with it, with it. And I mean, the graphics handling the game is awesome. This is pretty awesome. Like, touch anywhere. And uh, let's see. Let me see how he did it. Oh, So this is how it goes, guys. Look at the graphics on this. And you're using your mouse. Use your mouse. So let me close this. I'm going to go back. But this is this is awesome. I mean, it's just like running an operating system, like the Android operating system, like a tablet version on your PC. I'm super excited. And the reason why I'm super excited is because now I can start doing a lot of testing. Uh, I did get myself a, a Galaxy, which runs an Android device. But I'm so hesitant of testing stuff out, like rooting and all that stuff, because I don't want my I don't want my device to, you know, to brick on me. Uh, but hopefully you guys enjoyed this kind of review thing of this Andy's Android operating system. Uh, this is so awesome. Again, at the bottom of the video, the description part, there is a link that takes you to uh, my website. It gives you a rundown step by step of how to install this and get yourself up and running. I'm also going to provide you the link at the bottom to get this particular download and the website of Android or AndroidRoid.net. <laughs> Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Leave comments below, leave thumbs up, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace out.